In this video, we're going to go over the behind the scenes of your Show It dashboard within WordPress. So this is how you are going to manage, update your blogs. Um, I'm going to just walk you through the entire process. So this is what the dashboard looks like when you hop on. You can make a draft post here. You can see all of the stats, um, any news. Um, at a glance would be like the pages, comments, posts, etc. We have a link to your media library, pages, comments over here. You won't need to worry about appearance or plugins. We will manage all that um, on the show it side um, because show it is actually how you're going to design your blog. So the first thing you're going to want to do is click over here on posts. And that'll take you to all of the posts that you have created. Um, I would highly recommend not worrying so much about SEO for the title, but mainly worrying about like an attractive title that will catch a visitor's attention. Um, you can always put SEO after that, um, just like a short sentence um, or within like the tags over here um, and within the blog post itself. So these are categories that visitors will click on to see your blog post. So generally I recommend like having those by like session or educational, personal, um, et cetera. So if someone wants to see wedding um, galleries, you can have it ta uh, categorized with the wedding category. Um, tags would be the same thing, like where it's at, what kind of session, et cetera. So if you want to ever edit this, you can click quick edit. You can edit the tags, the category, the title. Slug is what comes after your main domain name. So you the URL. Um, you don't need to have it super long, but um, this will just auto populate with whatever's in the title if you don't mess with it. All right. So if you want to edit this in more detail, I'm going to click on the post itself. And that's going to load up. This uh, was imported via Show It from an older blog. So in order to edit it, it has like the text here. You don't need to worry about the styling. Um, you can drag and drop in media and add it from your library. If it ever um, populates with lots of white space from like show it, when show it brings it in, you just need to delete it. Um, it can sometimes do that. Not a big deal. Um, it's just a little time consuming to fix it up. So um, if you want to change the categories, you can change those here, adding any tags here. Setting your featured image is something that you will want to do because this is what show it's going to grab in your blog. Um, so you can grab that from your media library here and just set it. Um, if you ever want to add more media, you can click on the media library, drag and drop those in. You can see the pages here. Um, you really don't need to worry about this. This is basically like categories. Um, show it on their side. We'll pull all that stuff in. And then comments are where you can filter out. Like this one is a spam comment. So you want to delete it. You can just come over here and click spam and that'll delete it. Spam. Um, everything else looks fine. And that's about it. It's pretty self-explanatory when you get like the basics down for how to post and make sure they're all categorized with the proper categories and all the media is uploaded properly. Um, so again, make sure the title is an attractive title. You don't need to worry about so much SEO within the title. If you want to add SEO, that's fine. Just add it at the end. Um, always make sure you categorize it with the right category um, because that's what show it's going to use to find where that blog post goes within your website, um, tagging it and filter out those spam comments. Let me know if you have any questions and I'd be happy to make a specific video all about that just for you.